Hey, I'm Zane, and I'm a very curious person. Whether it's people, places, or ideas, I'm always on the hunt for something new. I'm going to talk a little bit about why curiosity is important to me, as well as why I think it should be important to you. So there's this idea out there called unknown unknowns. It's basically all the things that you have no idea, you have no idea about. Things that are so far off your radar, you don't even know to be looking for them. I view my curiosity as an attempt to overcome my own personal unknown unknowns, and I've tried to do that with three habits I've developed. The first is what I call my funnel system, basically trying to read as many news sources as possible, and then saving just a small percentage of those news sources as articles to read later when I know I can focus on them. I use an app called Pocket to save articles, and Pocket tells me I read 5.2 million words last year, so this is definitely something I spend a fair bit of time on. The second habit, which is one I've really enjoyed working on, is watching as many foreign films and documentaries as I can. I feel like we all live such a narrow slice of life that foreign films are a great way of seeing just what all is going on in the world and what, how people are living their lives all over the globe. The third thing I've been working on lately is trying to schedule one or two lunches each week with someone I'd like to get to know better. Could be a friend I haven't seen in a while, could be someone I don't know that well but I'd like to get to know. Here at Kelly, we have such a great, diverse community. I've been able to develop friendships with people from all over the world by having these lunches, and something that I've really enjoyed and felt lucky to be able to do. I've been thinking a lot, though, about why I'm curious and what benefits it brings to me, and I think there's two main advantages. The first is serendipity. I feel like by serendipity, I mean luck, that it makes me luckier in more situations. I'm more likely to know something interesting or useful in any given situation. The second thing that curiosity does for me is connections. I feel like by reading so many different news sources, I'm able to connect ideas from all over, as well as by meeting so many people, I'm able to connect people together that either would enjoy working together or enjoy just getting to know each other. There's another kind of connection I want to talk about, though, in closing, and that's empathy. I really strongly believe that curiosity is a way of developing your ability to be empathetic with everyone around you. I read somewhere that being curious about where people are from is an incredible and important skill to have, and I've definitely experienced that in my own life. When you're curious about where people are from or what they're hoping to do, you're able to strike up a conversation with them no matter where they are, what situation you're in, or how well you know them. I believe really strongly that if we were all a little bit more curious about each other, we'd be able to find ways to work together better, find ways to solve bigger problems, and find ways to make the world a better place. So that's definitely the kind of progress I'm aiming towards with my curiosity.